you know, it's exciting that we end up with uh, the, being the most nominated studio at the Oscars this year with our films. And some of our members around the world uh, use the awards piece as, as a sign of what they want to go watch. Do Oscar nominations actually influence people to watch Oscar nominated movies? For Netflix, it's hard to say because the subscription based streaming platform doesn't consistently release viewership numbers. But other streaming platforms like Fandango Now, which sells and rents individual titles and bundles, notes that awards are influential for its users. Since January 13th, when the Academy announced its Oscar nominations, the top selling 2020 nominees on the platform were Joker, Maleficent, Mistress of Evil, Parasite, Once Upon a Time in Hollywood, and Harriet. Joker is pretty notable, not just because it's holding the number one spot for Fandango now, but because it's also maintained a relatively strong box office presence. The film came out on October 4th, so almost everyone who wanted to see it likely already did before mid-January. But after Joker was nominated for 11 Oscars, it experienced a 450% bump in box office revenue. Cameron Douglas, Fandango Now's vice president of home entertainment, told Newsy, Because of the value of having a nomination, I think it brings in a completely new audience. The same happened with Moonlight in 2016. After the film was nominated for eight Oscars, its box office revenue went up by 111%, and its peak at the box office happened the next month. After winning Best Picture at the Academy Awards, Moonlight played at more than 1,500 theaters and made more than $3 million in just one week. Beyond the big screens, streaming platforms like Fandango Now, Amazon Prime Video, and Google Play are capitalizing on these honors, too. Each of them has a specific page for this year's nominees, and Joker is the top-selling film on Google Play, just like it is on Fandango Now. Outside of these examples, however, some experts are still unsure about the impact of award shows. Mike Milligan, a senior director at the digital media and technology company Limelight Networks, told Newsy, Award shows are a great tool for building hype around new streaming series and movies, especially as more content from Netflix and Amazon, among others, earn big nominations. However, our survey found that only 13% of global viewers depend on news coverage to discover trending streaming series and movies. This means that award show buzz might not be a deciding factor in whether viewers tune in.